Just a miracle how the whole thing came together so beautifully. Pine Springs was something, it was, it was basically planned, but actually it was spontaneous combustion. <laughs> Long ago, before the time when the indigenous peoples of this land suffered terrible atrocities, the Navajo twin prophets of old foretold of their eventual return. In 1962, when a small group of Navajos recognized that the Baha'i faith fulfilled their ancient prophecies, a council fire was planned to share this news with their relatives on the Navajo Nation. When he heard about the gathering in Pine Springs, rode his horse all over the Navajo Nation, inviting people, telling them there was a very important meeting in Pine Springs and they really needed to come. Uh, the day came when the, um, for the meeting to begin, just people started coming from, from all over the country, might say. It turned out to be an international conference. It was uh, beautiful. Lots of people, different area they came to. And I was touched just being there around so many ethnicities and people from other countries. It was amazing. And Franklin, my brother, was the, the MC. We took turn. I would translate most of the English way of speaking. There were some Plains Indians, some Sioux and the Cherokee and uh, some other tribes came, the Hopis. A representative was sent from all over, all the way from Samoa, yes. And this was just absolutely amazing uh, to, to see so many people. And the local people were so impressed with this, this gathering, this meeting. Some people say it was over a thousand people that came. <laughs>